<laughs> hey guys welcome back to Isabel's moments um in this video we're going to do a cross stitch floss tube update for all you guys so thought it's a little different because I didn't want to bring in my table because I had just injured myself while making scarves for the homeless. I, you know, you have those rotary cutters and you like hold it down and you're like cutting this way where I had lost attention for a split second. I looked over and like I was trying to like get it to go and it finally went and then realized um, my finger was in the way and then I just started like gushing blood like it was blood was coming out and I had to like catch it with my other hand and it was it was wonderful <laughs> oh wonderful so how are you how are you people's how are you guys doing I'm having a little rough week but um we're getting there last couple of days have been better beginning of the week was a little rough but we're getting better um, I have some haul. I've got some progress on my lips to show you. And I have an exciting, I have something to show you pertaining to my lips. What should we start with first? I think we should do haul. Moldy the hawk. I don't know. I never know what to do. So I went to my L L and S. Is that how you say local L S N? Local stitching. Local needle work like whatever. Your <laughs> local needle workshop. Um, because I went in there because I had already ordered two things off of one, two, three stitch, but I wanted to get another pattern, but I didn't want to pay shipping. So I went in there to see, and I think it was, um, for my big toe, um, cat sleeve paw prints. They, I think the saying is cat sleeve paw prints, or cat sleeve paw prints on our hearts and scratches everywhere else. Something like that. So they were able to get that ordered. So I'm waiting for a call to tell me that it will come in. But while I was in there, I ended up, and I think this is a little blurry. I think um, this is called the Tribal Pumpkin from the White Willow. White Willow? I don't know. Anyway, it is, I thought this was so cute. And they had it in the display. So, um, they had the, the orange and the brown. So I was thinking I might do this, because it's only two colors. You do a col the color with the pumpkin, and then the leaves and the brown are another color. So I was thinking maybe doing like a blue pumpkin with a silver... Uh, stem and stuff and that would be like really cool all year round but I don't know I thought this was like what caught me is I don't know if you can see it but down here there's two hearts in there and I thought that was so cute so cute but yeah um it only calls for two colors 830 green oak brown and a light tangerine, 742. And then they, I can show you this page, because it just has the GMC and the count. But they have a couple other designs that they do. They have a cat and a dragonfly and a seashell. I might get the cat, the cat looks really cool. The cat design looks really cool, and I have a cat. That'd be kind of fun to do. Ooh, maybe I can do it and make it look like my cat. Do you like black on top and then like white on the bottom? Maybe, maybe somehow make it look like my cat. We'll see. That might have a little like brain power that I might not have. And they put it in this really cute bag and I loved it. 
Hi. Sorry. Yeah. And he didn't realize I was recording. But that's okay. Anyway. I was showing you that. Anyway. Um, the second thing I got was obviously from 123 Stitch. First time ever ordering there. I got two patterns. I could have, I should have gotten like three. Um, I got two cut, two. I, I'm struggling here because I don't want to bump my fingers. Um, so I got, I'm going to show you this one first. I'll show you the last one. Um, it's by Lizzie Kate Boo number zero uh, zero four. And I didn't have a Halloween pattern. I don't know if all Stitch is which holding the hand, but I like the boo and the spider coming down. Maybe I could make like a spider web coming out here somewhere. I don't know. Yeah. So it has a list for sampler threads, DMC, and anchor. And it Tells you the fabric, yeah, and everything. So we'll see. I don't know if I'll start that this year. Oh, I guess there is a spider web in here. I just didn't realize it was there because it was like really dark. Anyway, I think that's the metallic. Anyway, that is Lizzie Kate. And then the other one I got was Lizzie Kate Cat Lessons for People. Number 142, and I'll read you what it says. Cat lessons for people. Be persnickety, play with your food, appreciate wildlife, nap every day, don't bite, when a hiss will do, practice patient, listen before speaking, when you make a mess, bury it, sit very close to those you love. Aww. Yes, and this is gonna be <laughs> A very but in this one I like the the quote but I don't necessarily like dark colors I like bright colors I like bright colors so I might be changing threads I might be putting I might be changing the colors of the words to like a, a couple of blues that I like like a nine nine six and maybe a three eight four four I think is another blue but some blues I don't know We'll see. Or maybe I'll just use blue fabric. Like something like that. I don't know. <laughs> I will definitely update you because I'm all mad. Mystery. Stop it. She's chewing on the cord and I'm trying to like. Hey. There's nothing I can. <laughs> Sorry about the yelling. Stop. Sorry guys, my cat just does whatever she wants. So last time I was working on this um, scarf, I got a little bit further, and by a little bit, I mean a little bit. <laughs> um, I just got a little bit. I don't remember where I was last time, but I got a little bit further. Maybe I'll have some more progress next time. We shall see. I don't end up working on this very a whole lot. Uh, the next one I will show you. I will show you the pattern first. Or not the pattern. Can't show the pattern, but the picture. It says Mega Splash and you have Ariel and Blonder. And then I will show you where I'm at. Ta-da! So I think last time I had everything but her skin and then this part right here. So I'm making good progress. And once I do the back stitching once I'm done, it will definitely look good. But isn't that looking wonderful? It's looking great. This is taking a little bit longer than I thought it was. 
but I haven't been stitching a whole lot, so it just is what it is. I've kind of gotten a little bit back into diamond painting, but I'm still on that. I'm too tired to do anything right now. I'm trying to get this one out. This one's a fun one. So I will show you. You saw nothing. <laughs> you saw nothing. So I will show you the pattern. Not, I say the pattern, it's the picture, not the pattern. Not the pattern. This is what I'm working on. It's Lyra by Mc. Makaya Gemgelina. I'm butchering that name. I know I can't read or spell, but isn't she pretty? I was just working on this corner right here. And I got a page finished. So let me show you that. And since I have since I got the page finished, I haven't I haven't worked on it since, so but you guys haven't seen, so I will Insert a picture here to show you the last time. The last time where I was last time. Alright. Are you ready? Are you ready? So you saw what it was last time. So I'm trying to I'm trying to do this with my malformed finger and it's difficult people <gasps> and this is where I'm at oh my gosh so I as you can tell I filled in here and I did all this up here so I filled in her hair so you can kind of see her hair coming through and then the coral in her hair doesn't that look amazing guys that looks so, let's see if I can do this um, handed. So, this, this is where I'm at. So you can see the coral and then the part of her hair coming out. So yeah, I'm gonna have to move this key snap over and then do some more gritting. But that, is all I have for you. I don't have any finishes. I have a page and it's really exciting. I just haven't <sighs> haven't gotten to the second page yet, which I I should. Maybe I'll do that this weekend. So hopefully I can get more of the splash done. Maybe I can get the word splash done before I see you guys next time. And then I will definitely have progress on this one. Maybe I'll get, I'll, maybe I'll have a couple column, columns for you guys. But I made some progress and I felt like I should share it with you guys. Um, thank you guys for watching, subscribing. You guys are the best. You are the best. Like, I know I say that, but legit, you guys are awesome. And thanks for all your love and support. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.